Begin with breaking news at noon. The Supreme Court struck a blow to affirmative action at colleges and universities across the country, ruling it unlawful in the admissions process. Here's what happened. The court says that Harvard and the University of North Carolina's race conscious admissions programs violate the Equal Protection Clause of the 14th Amendment. Lawsuits against the schools claim the policies discriminated against white and Asian American applicants. Universities who have been bracing for this decision have already begun thinking about alternative ways to increase diversity on campus. So we might see colleges and universities put more weight, for instance, on um, where did you grow up? Do your parents have graduate degrees? What zip code did you grow up in? The Supreme Court upheld using race as a factor in college admissions programs as recently as 2016, but that was before the court's makeup moved sharply to the right with a six to three conservative majority. North Carolina Governor Roy Cooper reacted to the decision, saying in part, campus leaders will now have to work even harder to ensure that North Carolinians of all backgrounds are represented in higher education. The governor went on to say and to ensure strong, diverse student bodies at our colleges and universities to train the next generation of leaders for North Carolina and the nation.